I mean, it's easy in American discourse to talk simplistically about the far left and the far right as two equally dangerous fringe blocks. Elon Musk has done it plenty of times just in the past week. But here's the difference. America's far left wants to give us free health care and free child care. America's far right wants to give us white supremacy and no democracy. And this asymmetrical polarization of U.S. politics would be laughable if it weren't so horrifying. We are living through an unspeakably dangerous moment. The pro-QAnon, pro-neo-Nazi faction of the Republican Party is poised to expand dramatically come the midterms. We're just two years away from Donald Trump very possibly re-seizing executive power. If that happens, we may look back on this past week as a pivotal moment when a petulant and not so bright billionaire casually bought one of the world's most influential messaging machines and just handed it to the far right.